What's going on, guys? Welcome to PHP 89, guys. What's up you guys, welcome back to PHP 879 It's still not ready, I mean my bike, uh, the garage is looking a bit of a mess, I need to clear up this week But yeah, it's still not ready, still waiting for the parts guys Got the new fender on, the shorter rear muscle fender, there's the stock one, it is up for sale Plus the actual sissy bar, the backrest and the light as well This week I'm going to be dropping off my stuff to get them back together Because it should be done today, this week sorry But yeah, my bike, I mean, uh, I miss it, I mean I'm, I'm lucky to ride my brother's bike but you know, um, when you have your own bike, you just want to feel it on the road, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I am tired of it. You know, we got the rear swing arm off, we got the front forks off, the wheels, everything off the, the rear except the suspension itself, but the front forks getting redone. And also, I've got the new levers on the front as well, which I'm looking forward to having that on when actually riding the bike, because apparently they make a big difference and it makes it really nice and smooth. Yeah, soon, soon, soon. I'm gonna actually show you actually what's going on. So I've got the front forks off basically, and the wheels off the entire front end basically and the rear end except the suspension it's up it actually itself so what's happening is they're getting sprayed up and um yeah something interesting i'm gonna show you the color right now bam there we go that's the color it's going however there's a slight catch to it this is how it should look like after the color is done with the wheels being um, polished, so ceramic polished, and then basically, oh my bad, and then basically um, uh, powder coated. That's what gives the effect, which I'm hoping to give you a photo in the next video of the, uh, the wheels itself. But I mean, this is how the wheels look like really at the start. And um, you know, they're just basically aluminium polished and they just pit and pit. So I wanted to give them sprayed by something quite cool looks different and also is worth it and hopefully it turns out like that video right let's go on to the road shall we i've got you linked up with my mic slightly differently with an adapter my mic i'm gonna do a check basically on it and then uh, we're gonna see if it actually works so yeah stay tuned right also guys if you haven't done so please like and subscribe 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 that'd be great i'm gonna talk through basically today's video of why i started this youtube channel and why where where this is going to be going in the future it's uh something very interesting that i'm looking forward to but these next few minutes basically explain to me if uh when i check this video on my laptop if it actually made a difference while riding because the problem is you can hear me in both headphones right now but if you um if we go for a ride it becomes a problem with the um with the sound and the noise of the bike and you can't actually hear me talking so let's see wagwan cold start that work don't know if it did guys so we are back we are back with the old mic setup i don't know if it worked but thumbs up if it did work you know what i mean so i'm gonna explain to you exactly why i started this channel it's called ph3879 acronym for 
petrol head visions 1879 petrol head being the fact that we are petrol heads obviously we love noise we love engines we love the uh, the joys of noise basically and also fast cars fast bikes fast jet skis everything guys second of all uh, visions is what vision do you have you know what vision do you have for your petrol head masterpiece you know what what's the vision the modification why modify something that is going to be so already looking perfect why is that you know and also i used to do this in the past without vlogging and now without youtube i had a ford fiesta i'll show you a picture this ford fiesta was my pride and joy i loved it to pieces it was an air suspension it had one of the craziest wheel setups on a ford fiesta in the uk absolutely loved it i only did it because i was in love with the vw scene which in turn ties in with this and i explain to you in the future why but yeah that's why um, i'm starting this channel because we love motors we love customizing these machinery mach machines to make to look absolutely insane and we're going to be doing this hopefully on not this bike this is my brother's bike on my bike but it has done some modifications to it so carbon fiber in the front exhaust system a lowering kit on the back and also a few bits from the headlight and it looks insane and the rear plate but guys phv is all about everyone not me it's about everyone and yeah you know if you start a youtube channel you might you will always get a bit of hate so actually when you start something up people hate on it it's just natural because first of all are jealous or they just yeah they're just idiots or they're just keyboard warriors simple as that but at the end of the day i started because i would love to have a community where we have a few rides together with a bunch of boys and you know vlogging it taking some decent content and then maybe in the future may yeah, earn some money in on, on the channel and then bring in some other new rise to the game to the to the to the channel and that is my hope my 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 passion this is my passion my fitness and this is my second passion because i love these things these machines these engines these noises cars bikes jet skis boats everything i just that's what it's about that's what php is about guys and i started this because of what i used to have in the past and mainly riding riding is the is the is the is the top the top thing with the bike itself on cruises with the boys with anyone for that matter but then also when you're in the car going to a car show going to a car meet it's the before event that happens the to the cruise up to the event that to me is the best thing if you do think so please leave in the comments what you think is the best time of having your masterpiece and ride into an event or even just going for a ride what is um the best part of it and that's what petrol head visions is about petrol heads being the fact we're petrol heads and also the fact that we love a vision of our masterpiece and we're going to move forward with that right i've got to actually go down to the shops i want to talk you through more about the whole idea about petrol visions and hopefully the future of it that's the main the main thing about this guys let's get another start up i really hope the mic did work earlier with that adapter because that means that finally the content looks good well it looks it looks good i'm not saying it looks insane but then also the content sounds good and i have a full thumbs up for everything working perfectly so um that's that's the main goal and th this is not easy work guys to get yourself vlogging on a this is a loud bike as well so doing that and uh talking yeah your equipment has got to work together oh my gosh just making sure we're on record oh this thing what a noise it makes so i started doing this because first of all i thought you know what it gives me a reason to modify my my own personal bike for the sake of you know it it's it's what i like doing and also learning about the bike as well but also who who, who on here who watching this right now would love to be able to modify their bike but not have to pay out of their salary of expenses but they pay doing it as a living so that meaning who knows maybe in the in the future we could be modifying other bikes this bike and it's my job how about that how about how about doing that for a living full-time i mean everyone wants to be a youtuber and also 
I think anyone can be a YouTuber. It doesn't matter who you are. I watch all these creators on YouTube and some of them, they are good in their own personal way. Some are good because they just vlog and vlog and vlog. They might not be interesting in our way, but at the end of the day, it is real reality TV. People are editing and posting up online for you to watch. I find it mad. And I kid you not, about, about a year, two years ago, my best mate Joey, my best Joey, 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 Joey. We used to, we used to, I used to go around his house and then basically, well, I still go around his house. And um, basically like, I, was, I saw him watching YouTube and I was like, what are you doing, bro, watching YouTube? And um, I just could not believe it. It was a waste of time that he was watching YouTube and I was, I was so against it. I was like, bro, that's a useless bit of television time you're doing right there. And let, let, you know, let's just see what's going on right now. I'm basically uploading onto YouTube and using the, the platform. I am on the game. So, you know, I never thought that it was ever possible to do things that you actually would love, post it and maybe even get paid for it. And yeah, I mean, that to me is like, it's a no brainer. I'm doing it as a hobby right now. I'm enjoying it. And it gets me out on the bike more often. And also it gets me out the boys more often as well. Ugh, school traffic. Turn around, I'm not having this. joke so yeah that is my game plan you know getting paid getting paid for something that you would be doing and loving it I mean come on yeah, some people are getting paid for riding their bikes that's insane and then also making more content by buying more bikes, more cars, and then some people even buying supercars. I mean, that's insane. But for me, it gives me a big, big excuse to get out on the bike and take some interesting videos for you guys. And that's why I'm doing it. Because it's my, it's, it's my only hobby. I've given up cricket, that was my other hobby. Given it up because I, I tried to go professionally. It wasn't good enough for it, I'm not gonna lie. It just didn't happen. But I gave my best. I love the sport, I still watch it, but I don't wanna play it anymore because it takes so damn long to watch play the game something else i'm going to enjoy full time for myself that's that's all it is that's all it is you know I, oh let's go this way actually let's go this way we'll take you on a speed run oh gosh this thing is just beautiful absolutely beautiful cruising loving it i mean yeah 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 Beautiful. videos about the V-Rod, you know, about my Harley Davidson V-Rod, or even my brother's Harley Davidson V-Rod, but at the same time, I haven't got anything else to post about that is that interesting due to my channel. I might have one more thing that is my best mates and his brother's business, who they work on insane cars, they work on ridiculous cars, I've got two videos on some cars they've done, a Bugatti Huara, what's up bro, a Bugatti Huara, and also, They've done the Porsche G3 RS, and that's only the, the small bits of them. They've had plenty of other cars out there that they've done at their unit. And what they do is they do PPF and detailing, and plenty of other customizing things like wraps and all that kind of stuff. It's an absolute dream of a company they are doing, you know. What a, that's an actual petrol head dream right there. The, the actual, 
the actual plates that they are they work at the setup the just the, the, the even the even the pictures and all the all the, all the stuff around all the equipment it's insane they even had a mclaren center in there one time a ferrari f12 they've had so many cars and they are doing so so well for themselves you know they found themselves in a bit of a pickle a while ago but now they've got their own business they're working together and i think it's an absolute great great little uh thing they've got going on as two brothers so that is another option but you know i've got to also i've got to also um i've got to also respect their clientele uh professionalism which is that's their business but i'm not part of their business you know i might be friends with them and um that, i i respect what they have as a job therefore i'm not going to intrude and actually um get involved with uh you know uh, taking videos of cars that is their their clients so at the end of the day i've got to wait and see and that is the um who knows in the future if i end up having more subscribers then like maybe they might ask me to, to post and use that which they are family to me and i'm happy to do that but here we go oh gosh this thing just wants to pull and pull and pull So, 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 so good. Oh, this is cold, actually. I mean, it's warm right now in the UK, but it's cold right now. Oh, this is what it's about. What a day. What the weather. Look at the weather. It's insane. Oh, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. about this bike if you're cruising that speed all the time it does break your back it does break your back oh, a little not nice me that is look at that mini cheese that is sweet a little bit of yellow going on Yeah, I can't I can't keep using you know I can't always think that I could just use my best mates and his brother's um, place of work for content. I mean I'd love to without a doubt. But at the end of the day guys that's their personal business and yeah I mean I wish they started their own channel basically because they'd get a lot of hits out of their own channel by doing that. Which uh, uh they've got the perfect content to keep doing that. Maybe one day Joey might start it himself. Um, and then they could use that kind of content, make some other decent content for their business itself. And uh, yeah, that's uh, that's a, one other place I could always in the future, but we'll see what's going on. But the main point of all this content is me on the actual, on the, with the camera and vlogging on the bike, uh, in maybe a car, that's, uh, yeah, if it's a, a good enough vlogging bit of action, then why not do it but yeah that is uh where i'm at right currently however this time of the coronavirus you may think it's so simple for people to make videos right now because it's so much time especially with people being followed off yeah they've got time off but it's the same videos over and over again and i'm tired of it i want other people's bikes involved i want not just my bike or my brother's bike involved i want us to be involved in it too and uh with everything happening you can't do that you know i have to be alone to be on the bike really and uh do these kind of videos and it's getting repetitive i know it is however i'm trying to make it as good as possible for you guys but at the end of the day we have to have some more riders don't we really come on now do you not think so that has to be done so um we are so close to opening back up with the uk and um you know the, the rules will be relaxed and uh in april time at the end of april we have our first meetup with the b-word boys and oh my gosh some of the boys have done some insane stuff some absolutely crazy crazy stuff i'll take you one of the first guy one of the first bikes that was started off last year and had been uh, changed up by alan's bike check this out it looks crazy took it apart 
and then basically he put it together like this insane orange on the wheels looks so 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 dapper that front wheel 26 inch front wheel is incredible i can't wait to get some actual footage and just see that bike in person and then my other boy and Hans got his bike all changed up a bit of a star trooper look obviously going on on that it looks crazy it's on air ride both alan's and Hans on air ride and got a 300 inch rear wheel a 300 inch 300 millimeter rear wheel on the back of his v-rod i can't wait to see how wide that is in the future i'm gonna do something like that but i ain't going 300 we got 360 baby fair b you get me look, look what he uses his his mom's hair dryer to do cars hey it makes money tell me Oh, bit of magic, bit of magic. What are you wrecking over there, Joey? Joey's gonna buy a V-Roll soon. Why not? Why not? Let me go, baby. Because you need to vlog stuff that's... This is the big boys vlog, bro. Yeah, it is interesting. Look at what you look at. That's what, 130 like grand. Ah. No, that's what, I mean, that's what you do. No, I'm gonna get And you videos, buddy, sh**. Like, like this, like this. Sure, I'll be good. We're going to vlog Mike's video. What we do is we're going to video Mike's video. You're all savage. Just because you can't get a nice car yourself, you know what I mean? Can you lie the ramp for me? Yes, Sahib. Sahib? Why are you unknifing to that, bro? Why are you knifing it? Look at this, it's savage. You want to cut it? You want to cut the car? That's what I'm trying to do. Wow. I don't know what's he doing, does he? Doesn't have a clue what he's doing. He's taking out the edges. Joey's PBF in my bike for free next. Oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> if I get if I get a thousand likes, Joey, you gotta do it for free, yeah? If you get I, I don't even get, get like five likes in a video, let alone a thousand bro. If you get fifteen thousand likes, I will do that bike for free. That's on video. That's on video, yeah? Say it again, Joey. What's going on, guys? You know, yeah, that last clip you just saw, yeah, my GoPro just stopped recording it on why. So I'm gonna end the video on this last little section. Um, I'll talk about what's happening with the wheels. So the wheels are getting done as we speak. And um, it's a, an amazing color cut. It's an insane job. And um, I can't wait to have it back. Hopefully the next video um, will be the actual entire um, bits done. But um, yeah, remember 15,000 likes for Joey. If uh, I get that, I probably won't. Um, 15,000 likes and I get the PPF for free. But yeah, that's just a big, big ask. Um, please guys, like, subscribe and look forward to the next video. I'll see you soon. UK rules are lifting, so it's going to be big changes for some new content. I can't wait. Have a good evening, guys. Like, subscribe. Cheers.